You got a new buyer that wants to look at homes for sale in the area and you're so excited because they're an all cash buyer. Oh, how the light is shining down on you today. It's a glorious day. If you want to be known for your expertise on looking out for your client, then think about having them sit down with your lender partner for a review. Even with the rates starting to creep up, it's still really cheap to use someone else's money. OPM, other people's money, right? Especially with the stock market performance right now. If you partner with a good proactive lender, it might be prudent to have your lender take a look at your buyer's financial status to determine if a cash purchase is in their best interest. If it is, great. The light is still shining and all is good. If not, you will look like a total genius interested in helping them with their purchase decision rather than looking for your own needs in a quick close. It's hard to predict the future in this industry or in the financial markets. Keeping your liquid assets may be a hedge on the market that will serve them better in the long run. If not, when the market forecast stabilizes is more predictable, they can pay off their mortgage. You know, showing your clients that you're looking after their best interest over yours should gain their trust and loyalty. And long term, that's a great thing. It's your reputation and you can take that to the bank. Now for minding your own business. This is the time of year that your past clients and prospects just want to feel the love, not hear another hard sell. Right now, everyone's inundated with ads for holiday sales, Cyber Monday, Black Friday, Pink Tuesday, Super Tuesday. Well, you get the idea. So whatever marketing you're doing to reach out to your database, wish them a happy holidays. Give them a holiday recipe or tip on how to fare all the craziness with a heartfelt, hey, we care about you. This is the one time of the year that just letting them know you're thinking about them and that you care goes much further than telling them why they should buy a home or why they should buy it with you. So be thoughtful, sincere, and give them something of value. Well, that's it for another edition of the Real Estate Insider Weekly. Thanks for watching. See you next week. Have a great day.